Protests have erupted around the country after police shot Jacob Blake seven times in the back in Kenosha, Wisconsin, on Sunday. And now, three days later, NBA players are protesting as well. The Milwaukee Bucks opted not to take the floor for their Game 5 matchup against the Orlando Magic in the first round of the 2020 NBA playoffs Wednesday afternoon. The Orlando players were intent on competing, they vacated the floor with four minutes remaining before tip-off as it became apparent their opponents would not be playing. Shortly thereafter, staff began removing equipment from the gym at the ESPN Wide World of Sports Complex in Orlando, Florida. We're tired of the killings and the injustice, Bucks guard George Hill told the undefeated after the game's designated start time on Wednesday. Kim Clement USA Today sports the decision comes in light of discussions among other teams on whether to miss their upcoming playoff matchups. Players in the NBA bubble at Walt Disney World have described feeling trapped and helpless as social unrest has once again returned to the forefront of the conversation. It remains unclear whether Milwaukee and the Magic will continue their series or, if they do, whether Game 5 will be rescheduled or considered a Bucks forfeit. According to the Athletics' Shams Sharania, Milwaukee players remained together in the locker room to call Wisconsin Attorney General Josh Call. Orlando players left the arena and have refused to accept the Bucks' forfeit. Milwaukee leads the Magic 3-1.